Okay, we will have begin with Syracuse, and let me remind you to please silence your cell phones. This is being uh, streamed, so uh, if you have a question, raise your hand, uh, wait for the microphone to get to you, then identify yourself by name and by media, uh, and then designate who your question is for. Um, with that, we'll go ahead and start, and to my left is Syracuse head coach Quentin Hillsman. Uh, Tiana Monacahia, Miranda Drummond, and Kara, Kiara Lewis. Uh, Coach, uh, just a brief opening statement, and we'll go to questions. Well, we understand that coming into this to this tournament, this is the best conference in the country. So we um, never come into these games thinking that they're going to be easy, no matter who, who we're playing. And, um, Virginia played a really tough game. They're, they have a lot of talent. They're a very good basketball team, and they play really hard. Um, they they really rebound the ball. Um, they made gang rebound, and they did a really good job. And gotta, gotta give Tina and the staff a lot of credit for getting those kids to play hard. Um, you know, we we just we just want to win the game. You know, we came out and I thought we played solid. Um, we 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 did a good job of taking care of the ball. We only had 12 turnovers in this game, so I was really really pleased with that. But overall, you know, it, it was just about having some balance and sharing the ball. And um, you know, we had four four players in double figures. We had great balance. We we're able to get a few players off the floor for, for, for a few minutes, probably play a few more minutes than we needed to play. But at this time of year, you know, it's about winning the game and we got to do whatever we need to do on to get W. So I'm just really happy for our team and happy for our effort. Okay, questions right here to the left. Ron Counts with Daily Progress in Charlottesville. Coach, I know the press is kind of a calling card of yours, but I was curious how you thought you guys did in that aspect today and how it affected the game, especially given UVA's short bench. Well, we just want to speed the game up, and a lot of times when you when you are pressing teams, everything is predicated on your on your on your turnovers. And for us, it's not predicated on that. We just want to get 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 pace and get tempo. And I thought that our press really 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 sped them up and, and allowed them. Well, sorry, it made them not run solid offense, and they couldn't really get down the court and, and get into a set. So that's what we really want to do: just not really guard the sets for the entire game. Right here in the front row. Uh, Jonathan Hoppy with the 89 Sports. Coach, it feels like the three, obviously it's still a big part of what you guys do, but it feels like it's a bit more well-rounded now and kind of complements the inside game. Has that been an effort in the last couple of months? Well, we were really talking about attacking the basket and attacking the paint off the bounce and off post fees. And our players are doing a really good job of, of really recognizing when they're open and, and when they're having good shots. And, you know, Miranda was really, really shot the ball well today. I thought Gabby shot the ball well today. And uh, and, and that was key. You know, we have, you know, two of your best shooters making, I believe, you know, it was six out of your eight threes. That's, that's really what you want. Tiana, what does it feel like today when you maybe have a little bit of an off game early? It takes a little bit to get going, but your teammates pick you up. How does that make you feel, especially moving into tomorrow? Yeah, um, you know, obviously I didn't have a great game. I had a couple turnovers and stuff but um you know it's always good when everyone's contributing to the game and everyone's you know giving what they bring to the table and I think that really helps us no matter who we play and no matter how I'm playing or what I'm doing like if everyone comes to the game prepared and ready like we can win Uh, Dakota Palmer, the news house. Miranda, you had three pretty big offensive boards in the third quarter and then one in the fourth quarter. Uh, how does that boost team morale after you get those second chance opportunities? Um, I, it's a good feeling, you know, um, I guess getting a rebound. That was one of my main focuses for this game is to, you know, box out and get as many rebounds as I can. And, you know, I feel like I guess they were big time rebounds, like you said, and you know, I felt like that kept our team going. Um, you know, we stayed positive and I thought that um, helped with our energy. It saves it. I want to chime in on that because it's very important that we understand this. It saves on possessions. You know, those rebounds in those games, in games like this, that means that we're playing offense for a minute, and that's that was critical down the stretch. Those those those, those rebounds, they were they were huge rebounds. I mean, they really sealed the game. It was a good job. Thank you, Kiara. You've really thrived over the past couple of months. If Tiana maybe is having a little bit of an off game, feels like you just kind of come in and and provide that spark off the bench. How do you think you fit into this team, and, and where have you found your groove? Because you've been very productive. Um, well, I know um, a lot of teams, you know, focus more on, on Tiana, so I think that's my opportunity to come off the bench, um, you know, and step up. And actually not starting, you get to see how the game's going. So I think um, that's helped me in the last few months, um, 
And I know a lot of teams are going to focus on Tiana, so that's my chance to step up and help the team. You know, just my last question for me. Looking to Miami, I know, Miranda, you missed that game, the game that they came into the Dome and beat you guys by double digits. Is it exciting to get back out there and get a second chance and, and have Miranda back in the lineup? Anybody? Yeah, I think for sure, um, you know, she's a big aspect of our offense, shooting threes, like that's what we love to do. And I think um, her coming into this game will really help us a lot. You know, um, it was a good game against them at home and not having her, you know, we struggled with the three point percentage on that game. So, yeah, I think it'll be good for us. Any more questions? Thanks, Coach. Thank you, guys. Thank, Thank you. you.